everybody, it's Casey Liama. I am here today to plan in my daily petite planner from Erin Condren. Um, this is how big it is. It's very pretty with the coloring of it. It has like my favorite colors in it. Um, this only goes January and March. It's only three months. And I am using this as my content planner for social media and my writing for my daily tasks that I need to complete. So we will see how this works out. I did want to put in, I wasn't sure how uh, this was going to work and or what I was going to actually put in this planner. So, um, I made some copies of it, and um, so I knew what I was going to do. So, I have a key that I just want to put up at the top. And I'm using the Erin Condren dual markers, dual tip markers. So... And try not to hit my um, tripod, but O2 will be blue. Planner will be red. And writing will be green. So I wanted to put my key up there so I remembered um, what I was working with. And I'm going to put in the O2 stuff first. Um, so these are posts um, to work my business, my O2 business. Um, I figured out that I want to post 13 times a week on um, Facebook is the social media platform. So I don't think I'm going to start. So O2 will be daily tasks that need completed. And... I decided to use these, I think. Um, I had these left over from my life planner with schools, their dots. We'll see how this works. So Monday, so we're just gonna start with Wednesday. I'm just gonna put a dot there and then write what the post is supposed to be about which is empower and it'll be on my group page and I did not write empower <laughs> I'm writing a story writing a novel and the main character's name is Ember so apparently <laughs> that is what's on my brain right now so <laughs> let's see if I can get this to work sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't okay <laughs> so empower These pens don't really write on um, wide out very well. So, future warning. So then, let's see. On Wednesday, there's going to be a... A lifestyle post 
and that's going to be on my personal Facebook page.
Okay, that took me way longer than I thought it was going to. Um, the little dot circles were really hard to get off. <laughs> um, this is also the first month that I'm doing this, and so hopefully next month it'll take less time. And next month I might rearrange um, some of these in a different order each week so that they're different for the post. But ideally, like on the first, <clears throat> the circle has a letter in it and that just corresponds to my VIP group on Facebook or my personal Facebook um, or my business page on Facebook. And then the word empower or lifestyle is just the type of post that I want to put out there. Um, so on Wednesday, I will post twice on two different groups um, for two different things about, um, so I just need to, what I'll do on my daily side is that, okay, so I need to post and power post on Wednesday. So then the day before or two days before, that's when I'm going to start generating ideas for that um, power and power word. And um, uh, Facebook and Pinterest let you schedule posts. Um, you can't schedule. Um, on your personal page but on groups and um, business pages you can schedule up to like two months in advance so like if I just you know on like say on the 6th I'm looking for lifestyle posts for Tuesday and I you know spend an hour and a half looking at lifestyle type posts and figuring out what I want to do I may figure out all of the Tuesdays for the whole month and already have that done. So that's very handy. Um, if you did not know that you could schedule post in on Facebook or Pinterest. Uh, so here is the O2 stuff um, that should ha happen this month. Um, so I did draw up my schedule YouTube schedule and YouTube is red oh. sorry I have runny nose <laughs> oh okay so The Petite Planner starts on Monday, right? Well, this one starts on Wednesday, but I'm only gonna plan until Sunday. And then the new week is the sixth. So I am going to be on a Monday start date. So the plan right now is, oh, and on, I'm going to put another key up here. Um, if it is a P like this, it's going to be to post to YouTube. If it's an F, I need to film that video. If it's an E, it's edit the video. Very simple, but I wanted to put my key up there just in case I forgot, because I'm very forgetful too. So this one should be pretty simple, like on Thursday. Um, so these blue, these are the days that they should go live on the social media platform, so I have to have them ready before Thursday. Um, so Thursday looks like it's going to have a lot to do, but really it's the day before. So on Thursday, I'm going to film my petite 
weekly. So fill that out for all of Thursdays. And then um, on Sunday, we're going to, I think I'm going to put it at the bottom, post the petite weekly. And I think my, this will also include, um, once I get to the weekly, sections, I think I'm going to include um, my life planner because I'm not I'm doing a couple of decorations, stickers in my life planner, but it's not like what I used to do. So I think doing this weekly and the life planner weekly together in the same video will be fine. And I probably should have done this monthly view by itself. But, lesson learned. So then the only other thing is on the 29th, I need to film the monthly petite. And then I um, need to post monthly. And then I am doing a meal planning. And I think I'll plan film. I need to film the meal plan on this day, hopefully. I really don't know. Like right now our schedule is pretty clear, but you know, things come up. So this post will, um, uh, posting this monthly, it, it includes the meal plan, month, monthly meal plan and the monthly petite and the monthly life planner that I do. <clears throat> so all of them will need to be posted on the 31st. Um, yeah, I think that's all of my, that's all my YouTube schedule, I think. So then green is my writing and, um, I really don't have any month. I mean, my, I have a monthly goal, and I think I'm just going to put this out here. And I want to be done with the first act of my novel project the, in the first draft. <sighs> And that needs to be 25,000 words. So by the end of the month, I need to have written 25,000 words, which um, makes up the first act of my novel. So that's my overall goal. Oh, and then um, I should get this done way before the end of the month. But I need to finish the Save the Cat beat board, which I've already started working on. I only have the last part of Act 3 to finish with Save the Cat. Um, I've really enjoyed reading Save the Cat book. Um, if you're a writer and you want to write stories, I highly recommend reading that book. Um, I got it fairly cheap through Barnes & Noble. 
I think it was only three dollars for the ebook. So okay. So we're at like a long time on this video. But this is my content planning and my writing goals for the month of January. So now I need to move this into the daily spreadsheet. So <clears throat> most of it is blue. O2 is gonna take up a lot of my time, which is fine. I think there's other things I wanna do. I think. And I'll just have to work figure out. So then on Tuesday, oh, this only starts on Wednesday. Okay, so Wednesday, bro two, I need to, oh, I'm just gonna write O2. And then on Wednesday, I need to get the empower post, entertainment post, and the product post. So my stickers. And product, I believe. That's what it said. And that's GBG. GBG. So that's what I need to work on post wise. Um. I'm thinking of this. My um, we have we have two cats, and usually my son does the litter box, but he is away at Grandma's this week, so litter box duty is now mine. So then, planner stuff is red. And I have nothing to do on the first for planner stuff. And then Wednesday is writing. And you can't see that. And I just need to write the first scene at 1,500 words. So, I don't have a highlighter. I think I'm just going to underline the week we're on. And... I probably won't fill this out until the 31st because I don't know exactly what will be on my to-do list. Um, the only other thing I want to do is write in my word of the year. Okay. Then on Thursday,
So there is the monthly content planning and then each the first week in January content planning. Um, and like I said, as I work through this, the first couple of weeks, I will figure out what my, what I really will do and what I won't do. Um, I will have the Erin Condren Petite Planner linked in the comments below. Um, also, I will link my referral. You get $10 off your first order when you sign up using my link. Um, there's no cost to you, just saving for $10 on any product of, on Erin Condren's website. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, I will definitely be splitting out um, the weeklies and then I will probably not do monthly and one week again because it definitely took a really long time to do that. Um, please comment below on your take of this. Um, do you guys have content planners? Um, how do you plan what you need? please comment. I would love to read them and check them out and see if maybe I could switch mine up later after I get going with this to see how well it works. Um, so I will catch you guys later. Bye!